Everything. Wolves three. Everton one. How does it feel? It's just these three games now. The the nine points out of nine in those three around us. They're vital. They're vital. Obviously, we've oh. seen. No worries. Um, we've oh. seen. Uh, <laughs> We've seen them struggle against the big teams, do so well against the... Struggle against the small teams, do so well against the big teams. And that one's just... Is that as good as Tottenham away? No, not quite. You're not going to get the views, are you? So? No, yeah, mate, I filmed <laughs> the cat on the pitch. Mate, it's proper 90 already, check it out. But, uh, but yeah, the cat, the, just, it just had everything. Dendonka scoring. Oh, man, I was made up when Dendonka scored. You know, he deserved that. The performance he's been churning out the past, past few weeks, you know, he's, he's come into the team and done really well. Yeah. And he's... He loves a Cruyff turn, doesn't he? He, he, does, get himself he, does. he loves a waddle, he loves yeah. a Cruyff turn, but mate, if it had capped it off, we just needed six corners. I had him and S to score, Wolves to win, both teams to score, six corners, 50 to one. But well, I bet you no, put about 30p no. on it, didn't oh, you? Oh, yeah, 50p, all day. 50p on never score first, 50p on Dendenko any time, so still I, a decent I, I, profit, I thought we mate. controlled the game from start to finish. Everton rarely threatened. Uh, oh, yeah. Fairly one dimensional. I've got a few mates who Everton fans who are sick of it and they want they want silver out, you know. You look at the atmosphere tonight and, and this afternoon, sorry. And it, it's just dead, isn't it? I've never come to a ground and the atmosphere has been so non existent. No, the, the main thing you saw from sixty five minutes they were leaving. It, it's not the North to, Bank. <laughs> <laughs> if Wolves are getting battered, mate, ask, you stay till at least at least eighty five. Uh, at least be seventy. Them. <laughs> no, but, yeah, it's just strange. I mean it, it, it woke up a little bit when they got the goal and a bit of a you only sing when you're drawing and all that, but it's a good finish from Gomez to be fair. But oh yeah, great find, great finish. I, I think if we didn't have a Neves or if Neves went, maybe I don't know. I, I just I, I liked him. It, I really it, liked it's him. just it's just a great performance, and like I said, that then dunk a goal as soon as that went in, Everton oh. knew it was all over. It's, and yeah. it, to be fair, it wasn't an easy finish. It was it was quite open. No. It in, he guided into the top corner. Um, first goal, definite penalty or. I mean, we saw nothing. But from where we were, we were right down hey, in the corner. We, li- we, li- front of <laughs> we literally couldn't see anything. So I don't really know. Apparently, it was b- basically the same as the West Ham one. One gets it given, was one Doherty, doesn't. He like, flicked it over Baines' his head, and he, uh, pardon the pump, but he had Baines on toast in there. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it looked like penalty. I mean, half yeah, from where I was, which was you know not a great view. It definitely looked no, like a penalty. Yeah, not a great view. Down and there. never duly stepped up and tucked into the corner. But the yeah. only the only negative from today really is neg- uh, is Neves going off. <laughs> negative. <Neves> going off. <laughs> yeah, maybe not. And uh, Neves going off injured. You know, it's, it could be a big blow if he's out for quite a long time. Yeah, I would say he did well. Didn't I? Didn't fear it when he went off. I mean, it looked like he sort of knew there was something wrong. If you know what I mean. And then he was like, all oh, right. Here we go. Uh, like it's the same with Baines as well. It was almost like, oh, this could happen. It didn't seem like he was too good. Uh, but yeah, I mean, hopefully, I mean, midfield in the week, it's probably going to be a Sace and a, a Morgan or someone like that. Yeah. So we're not going to miss him in the week. If he's back in a week or two, it's not too much of a... And especially now with the news breaking that we've sold out for Shrewsbury Town <laughs> in the FA Cup at home. Uh, where, where were you lot when we were uh, <laughs> not very good, I think it's the term. But yeah. man of the match today, Finn, who's yours? Jimenez, mate. It's always Jimenez. Oh, no, but I know, <laughs> then Donker did well and capped it off with a goal as well, unbelievable. I thought Jota, he just, this, so, those first 10 games, it was a different player. It, how he just glided he's, between he players. He does this thing where I think he's overrun it and then somehow just nicks it away. Yeah. He draws so many fouls. But for me, I, I thought Johnny played really well as well. You know, mm. he's got his permanent move and he looked, he looked really unhappy out there today. Looked like he didn't oh, want yeah, to be here. Gutted, absolutely gutted. But for me, it was Den Donker. Um, mm. If Adama would have come on earlier, I'd probably give him a the match. But, <laughs> of course, of course, yeah. but yeah, Den Donker. Two very happy Wolves fans, would you agree? Yeah, definitely. Only thing with Den Donker is I'm annoyed he didn't come to us. I thought if it was a goal down arm, yeah, I know. Wanted to be of a corner. I don't. Maybe he just wanted to it's wind probably what they do on the and... continent, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah but no, that's the only downside. And if that's the only downside, it's been a, a very, very good day. Don't forget to like and subscribe to Talking Wolves. Thanks, guys.